Moon Animator is a very popular plugin, having thousands of people use it. It is a plugin on Roblox Studio, and it basically helps you animate Roblox characters and objects. A lot of people use this plugin on a day-to-day -day basis, so when it was announced that it was going to be updated with a brand new update, a lot of users were excited. However, this update did not go as expected, and a lot of users were confused with a brand new message popped up in Studio, as well as a brand new logo. The logo changed to a logo that said $0.0 on the logo when you go to download the plugin. And then this particular message popped up that said in one of the tabs $0.0, which says, I released Moon Animator 2 in February 2020 for Roblox's plugin marketplace program. Roblox attracted developers into this program with words of opportunity and making a living. Roblox, a public company that earns hundreds of millions of dollars, took my work for zero dollars and zero cents. This creator six has accused Roblox of taking their work for zero dollars. Let's talk more about it. For those wondering, Roblox has stolen the plugin and hasn't paid six anything, not even a cent, and he has actually recently found this out a couple days ago. However, I want to make it clear, the plugin is still safe to update and install, and it's still completely functional. By the way, in this context, he doesn't mean literally stole his work, it's more of a figurative. It's because of Six's plugin that a lot of animators and developers alike can make animations with ease and accessibility, and there's honestly a reason why there's a million installs on it. With the successful games that Roblox profits off of, Roblox is technically profiting off Six's work because his work is a tool. Roblox could have at least had the decency to allow plugin developers like Six to have some sort of payment just like the game developers as well. And that's technically what he means when Roblox takes his work, that is a comment by Miscreates. Basically, Roblox RTC covered this and they said, Moon Animator has changed with a new message. The creator is upset that Roblox has paid him a total of zero dollars for his work. Multiple YouTubers have covered this, including Chloe Games, who the original idea was from. What are your thoughts? Now, in scrolling down, you can see a lot of the comments are actually against him doing this. One says, this is extremely petty. Roblox never agreed to play plugin creators, and even when you're in the plugin marketplace program, this makes your plugins available to download to the plugins marketplace and studio. Consider making the plugin paid if you think you deserve payment. Basically, and for all those people who are saying that, oh, why don't you just put it on sale? Well, unfortunately, most people can't. Selling plugins is actually a closed access feature given to specific users. And in Roblox's terms of service, they are allowed to take any asset uploaded onto the library. Technically, in legal terms, Roblox did nothing wrong. And I believe that people are exaggerating way too much about this situation. He put his plugin free, he has to understand the implications of it becoming free. Some people have even suggested a donation center that Six should be linking, therefore he can get some money off his plugins from volunteer donators on his free plugin. Theoretically, let's say Six wanted to sue, alright? He can't do that either because he waived his rights to sue when making the plugin and putting it on the Roblox marketplace. So technically, there is no way for him to gain money, because donations don't work either because Roblox actually doesn't let you devx donations. I definitely believe that he should be paid some in his work, however he's going to have to be paid in voluntary donations. Definitely, but I think there is one solution that could work with voluntary donations. For example, you could add a brand new feature in Moon Animator that you need to pay for. That's a way he could gain income off his work. Keep the free version, but also make a paid version. However, this would require some creativity in the process. Thank you so much for watching my video. I'd really appreciate it if you'd leave a subscribe. All this information is credit to Chloe Games, who found this information first, and then Roblox RTC credited her. So that's how it goes. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time.